This is our 2023 Winnebago View 24V like Victor for sale. This thing is in excellent condition and I just want to take you around to show you some of the features. You can see the tires are very deep. It has about just over 9,000 miles on it. Auto leveling system. Propane tank. 12.2 gallons. There is your dump. Black and gray. Black is by just gravity and gray is with the pump. on hot water here trauma truma the truma water take care of some of your trauma from being really dirty there's the outside shower and the fill this is the slinky holder 30 amp very long cable we do also have an extension. This is the back hatch. And take a look at the pictures that go along with this video. I'll show you is a full pass through. Well, three quarters pass through, I should say. We've got two paddle boards in there, some camping seats, and some of our extensions and surge protector all the stuff is included except for the camping stuff and the paddle boards of course some more storage this is where I put the tools this is an Onan quiet diesel 3200 generator very very low usage Works just fine. This is the outlet for the propane if you want to hook something up. This is our wet storage. Let's see here. It's got an out port. And the inverter is up here. Alright, as you can see, it's in excellent shape. We've got the awning. Pictures will show the awning out. All right, let's go on inside. The cockpit here, we have some two captain chairs, touchscreen Mercedes-Benz, Mercedes-Benz six cylinder turbo diesel. nice feature. Screen door. Take off your shoes please. Thank you. Let's go inside. Now this one we have the, the dual upgraded lithium house batteries. All your controls down here for the inverter, awning, steps, this is your auto leveling system lights so we changed out the table that we still have the original table we made a smaller one just so we can capture some more space and then we have this is with the the slide out up here I'm gonna give you some stock photos we keep all our storage up there 
um, like our dog fence, things like that. Super clean, but it is a full size bed up there with um, a AC vent mm -hmm. and the 12 volt and electricity. Put our games, there's the manual, full stack of manual that comes with the Winnebago. Mm -hmm. We have a double stainless here. You want to come up, babe? It's okay, we'll keep you off camera. So, and we have the stainless, the double stainless here. And we do have the most perfect. Oh, yeah, the dish drainer which may seem like a small thing, but it is absolutely perfect for washing and drying your dishes. Fabulous. Okay. We have the TV with the very, very high quality sound, sound bar. Okay, let's show you these windows. These windows are fantastic for all up weather. Upgrade. This is an upgrade. It says, Three position, there's one position, there's the second position, and there is the third position. Now they have all the windows in the house part of the RV do that. Which means that you can have them open when it's raining. And let's show you this other feature here. So you have the accordion style lines that attaches to the screen so you can have screen down partial up all the way up however you like it's great for blocking out light at night or deciding how much light you want to come in and still having some ventilation and we have an induction side and a gas side for the stove huge drawers huge okay. drawers these are straight up full house size drawers and they do light up each one of them has, you can see that reflection of the LED strip. Soft close. All right. We have a, what do they call this? A uh, convection, convection microwave. microwave. Right. Perfect shape. 12 volt refrigerator. Very nice size. Phenomenal. This means it, it gets cold within an hour and stays cold just by either the solar or running your running the vehicle. Yeah, the solar the solar charges the batteries and as long as that's going well then you're gonna have power to keep this refrigerator going as well. Now, when we're not using it, we keep the doors open so that the humidity does not build up inside. So it is in perfect shape. These are the controls. Generator, tank heater for those winter times. Water pump right now is off. We do tank levels. And the battery levels. There is the inverter control. There is the solar. We have two solar panels up top. Two 200 watt. Two 200 watt. This is your hanging closet. And this is also where we keep the, uh, the post stored right there. The For the table. And then the, the top of the table gets strapped in here. Now, more storage. Here, here, here. All around. We use this as our pantry. It's got three levels. Dog stuff goes in the bottom and all people stuff goes in the middle and the top. I'm gonna keep that down for when we drive. Okay, another television. Yes, and that 
Okay, so let's talk about these mattresses. So you got two twins here. So when we first got this, we liked the configuration because the middle part does slide out and it has middle section, so you can make it into a king, right? So that's handy, but you know, for sleeping, you got the two twins, so you have the option, but the beds were foam inside and they were hard. Now, we spent how much? So About $1,200. $1,200 on putting custom mattresses in here as comfortable as you can get for an RV. So we have already done that upgrade for you. This is set up here. And two full-size dresser drawers. <laughs> Got her hair stuff in there. Fuse block down here. All right. And then we did, uh, we have a clip on this side. A clip on this side. So if you want some privacy, we have our kind of forest motif here. And we just bring one clip over and it cordons off that part. And these, uh, these are up here. You can remove these if you want. These are some photography from Boulder, Colorado, Redwood Forest. Um, these also have pull down little basket for your stuff. And then all your like the your 12 volt. Right, yep. And then I, the copper wire that you see here is I strung up with non um, residual tape. It's like a little LED kind of fancy lighting. You can remove that easily and keep it does make for a nice ambiance and then these right here too you can go blue or if you hold it it goes full bright you've got both of those again another one for this side 12 volt usb and the regular ac power and another basket all right these are also very large we have these in here for different types of clothing so Plenty, and then they another smart TV here. All right. Which you can sync with this TV if you want to have the same thing playing in both TVs. You can do that, or if you want to have two separate things playing, you can. Mm -hmm. All right. So let's talk about this. Comes with the towel holders. Stainless. It's very nice. Porcelain foot flush toilet. Yep with a sprayer. With a sprayer. Can be used to clean or as a bidet. Straightforward plumbing. Plenty of storage. And then a really nice shower. Now we put this in. This was definitely needed. A bracket to keep the shampoo in there. This bar comes off or you can hang it for um, your towels to dry. Of course, you know, the ever needed bathroom fan. Everything, everything in this RV works. Everything. There is nothing that is in need of service or repair. Nice size medicine cabinet with the hang down tissue holder. All right. We also have to show the paper towel. Yes, the hanging paper towel dispenser. Okay, swing around. Take me out of the... Okay, yes, we, we just finished cleaning it, and so we're both kind of really sweaty, <laughs> not presentable. No. <laughs> so, but, yeah, so we can show you. That's the paper towel holder. It's, it's also here. It's a dispenser, so convenient. Yeah, and that, that's up underneath here. Pull that back up. And we keep storage. a Yeah, we keep a little air diffuser in there, an oil diffuser, some more storage. You got AC here, AC on this side. You got AC underneath here. Everything's very convenient. Cools down and heats when it's cold. Yep. Phenomenal. This here on the air conditioning unit, there is one air conditioning unit on the roof. And this one has a noise dampener as well. 
If now, you've ever been in an RV with an AC, you know you can't you talk know, over it. This yeah, one you, you can talk over. Yep. It also has the upgraded Max Air fan in the front if you just want a fan. Yep. With a remote control. With the remote. Got electric heat, gas heat, depending on if you're connected to utility. Okay, so what I do want to show you is, for me, when I... When we were shopping for an RV, one of the most important things to me is the condition of the roof. Um, that is such a telling story on how the RV was stored. Which, just to tell them where ours is stored. Oh, and before we go, yeah, any further, let's talk about the futon real quick. Okay. okay, so we changed out the double recliner for a futon. Now, this is our own. We measured it out. We found it online. Um, it does fold out, you know, if, when, it, when, it, when it comes out so you can really lounge nicely. Of course, the table has to move to this one. Um, and then we also have this adjustable bamboo thing here. So uh, makes it real easy to have drinks and stuff. Easy and accessible. Um, Pulls out to full lounge. Mm -hmm, does full for lounge. great TV watching. And we have gotten it all the way out to full bed. But um, to have that proper, you know, you really limit your space and um, you have to get a couple of like little uh, level, you know, like risers. little blocks, little block risers for these because then they, they kind of stand off because, you know, the futon is on the slide out platform. Now we do have the in storage, um, the original double, double recliner, recliner, perfect condition. Absolutely nothing wrong. It's just we wanted a futon. So that is and an option. You will reinstall it if that's what you want. Yes, yeah, super easy to install. You can have both. I think it's like six or eight screws total. Yeah. And seatbelts. Right, and it has the seatbelts. Okay, so I'm gonna go give you a tour of the roof. One moment here. And yeah, try. Don't try this at home, kids. Now this has a, a tow package. We have this clipped on for now, um, just so keeps the elements out of the hitch port. And um, it's a 5,000 pound tow. All right, going up the stairs. Give me a moment here. I'll stick you in my pocket. is the roof okay we also have the optional slide out tarp that rolls in and out that was an also an add-on air conditioning unit try to zoom in here everything is in phenomenal shape i am a huge stickler about the roof i am up here about once every other month to wash it down with the wash and wax and make sure everything is cleared off. I already got a leaf on there I gotta get rid of. And, but yeah, everything is perfect shape up here. Now this RV is stored under a carport that is sized for an RV. Sorry, gotta do it. All right. Um, so the top is covered. So we only get debris when we actually go camping and I try to clean it off as much as possible. Anyway, we have turned down RVs where the roof was obviously not in good shape, was worn, was not covered. All right, put you back in your pocket. We're gonna go back down. Now, this one also has the upgraded suspension package. So it does drive much more nicely than the standard one. Let you hold the road better. That was done at the dealership at time of purchase by the first owners. We are the second owners of this vehicle. It came from, I think Wisconsin is where we saw it. It's now in Florida. All right. I think that's it.
please, if you have any questions, give us a holler. We are selling this because, well, we are not quite yet at the retirement age. We thought we'd be able to use this more often, um, but unfortunately it sits more than what we want to use it um, due to our work and other responsibilities. So this is your opportunity to get a 2023 Winnebago View, 24 V like Victor for a price that's lower than all the other ones on the market. We are motivated to sell. Happy to have you. Take a drive with you. MSRP is well into the 200,000. Yeah, new on this one, you know, and, and let me check the mileage. Okay, break. Mileage. So the, the auto level, right, the stabilizer is letting you know, you better pay attention to it. contact us with the information provided. Thank you very much.